Today we're going to tie an improved uh, beta sparkle done. We'll be using the following materials. Um, we're going to use uh, basically medium dun zelon, dyed zelon, super fine gray olive dubbing, and dyed dun deer hair to tie this fly. Thread we'll be using is 80 uni thread in uh, olive dun. And to begin tying the fly, we're going to stack a wing of the dyed dun deer hair. What makes this an improved sparkle dun is you'll see here in a second is the backing, the wing backing of the Zelon. First we're going to tie that sparkle dun style wing on, compare dun style wing on. Trim it and notice we're using the right deer hair. We're going to get uh, a lot of compression with our thread. It will compress into the deer hair and we won't have a lot of bulk. Now, we're going to take our Z-line, we're going to run it up the back of the wing, and now we're going to wrap it back to form the shuck. This is also going to form the abdomen of this fly. Next, trim the Z-line. This is again your trailing shuck, the sparkle done. Now we're going to form the abdomen with just wraps of our working thread over the Z-line. And now finally, you can see that backing we took the shuck and ran it up the back of the wing, the deer hair wing, and now we're going to take in either halves or thirds, separate the wing and make a wrap of your thread through the deer hair to stand the wing up. This is very important that you do this. It'll really stand the wing of your sparkle done up. And it'll flare it nicely. Don't be afraid to take your fingers now and flare the wing side to side and now with the super fine gray olive dubbing we're going to dub a nicely tapered thorax this will really make this fly well proportioned just like the, the natural I like to make a wrap or two in front of the wing now with my dubbing and now just basically figure eight around the wing to form your thorax like such. And now we'll whip finish. And there is the finished improved beta sparkle done. This is a size 20. Um, you got the trailing shuck, a nice wing. The, the wing is very visible because it's back with Zelon. It floats a lot better and it makes this fly uh, that much more visible and the fish seem to really eat it up.